Stop digging in that okay. purse. Okay. Okay. I'm not digging on the... I'm not digging. Hey, hey, hey. On June 1st, 2022, officers conducted a traffic stop on a vehicle with a suspended registration. Inside the car, they discovered a suspicious female lying on the back seat. She wasn't ready to reveal herself and had a blanket covering her. Here's what happened next. Hey, was your buddy back here? Oh, you didn't know you had a person in the back? Why, why, why are you acting? This is a friend of mine, too. Open the door. It's locked. This is a good insurance card. That one's expired in June. He's trying to... Hey, let's see. Who are you? Watch it. Let me see your hands, bro. Back seat, let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. It's Carlsbad Police Department. Let me see your hands. Do it now. Do it now. Both hands. Okay. Now let's uncover who are you. What's your name? I'm sorry? Yes, speak up. Who are you? Well, you're laying down in the back seat. You're not wearing a seat belt, so that gives us reason to ID you. Well, I was, I was wearing a seat belt. I'm sorry? I had the seat belt. Yeah, uh, no, you don't have I a seat belt had, on. I know, but I had it on. While you're laying down in the seat, I don't, I'm not buying it. Who are you? I had it on. I'm sorry? I had it on. I no. took it off very all right, so you you got you got two choices, okay? You can tell me who you are, or we're gonna pull you out of the car, put you in handcuffs for concealing identity. What is your name? And uncover your face. Uncover your face. Now, what is your name? What is your name? Now, what is your name? I'm sorry. I can't hear you. Susie? Mm -hmm. What's your last name, like Susie? He was at the house. Okay, Susie, let's step out of the car. Susie who? Huh? Susie As soon as the female got seated back up, she began searching for something in her bag. Do Susie a Hendrick. Come here, boys. Get up here. What are you digging for? Your ID? Okay. Unlock it. Stop digging in the purse. Stop digging in that purse. Quit digging in that purse. Stop digging in that purse. Stop digging in that purse. Okay. Okay. I'm not digging on the. I'm not digging. Oh, no. Turn, turn. Oh, it's from my back. Oh, my back is from my back. From my back. My back is from the red side. Hands up, please. It is Eric Jordan. 141 to take. Over your back. My back is hurt. I'm a wreck, guys. Put on the front. Okay, so we're gonna take them off and we're gonna put them in the front, all right? Can you hear me? All right. I wasn't trying to do nothing. Just, I was just on my ID to get to no, my guy. She was awake when I was asking her for her name. All right. I uncovered her. I asked her several times what her name was. I even gave her the option to either tell me who she was or she was going to jump for concealment. Okay, then she gives me just a first name. Then eventually she gives me her last name. She, without her having a valid ID, okay, I have to assume that she could be potentially lying. All right, so now, I'm sorry? So you could have asked me who she was? I could have, but also at the same time, you could be lying for, to, for her. You know what I mean? I would you know have showed you a picture of her. Okay. Uh, you can show me a picture all day long, but if it's not a, a photo ID, I can't I can't prove that she is who you tell me she is. All right? The female was handcuffed and taken to the police unit for further investigation. I found a Susie Escareño Hotchiss in the locals. 
Now they're now they're going to be invalid. But there are certain things that we'll have to do for our safety. Yeah, I understand. Unfortunately, this is kind of one of those things. Yeah, it could have been avoided the very, from the very beginning if she would have complied with the security. Yeah, you want? We're going to put your pants on. Does that make sense to you, though? Okay. Because sometimes when she wakes up, she's not all there. Okay. She's been having problems with her uh, sleep pattern. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 What kind of previous injury did she have before? Uh, back. Like, is she, is she diagnosed with anything? Uh, they said that her lumbars, lumbars, and her spine is crooked. Had she have surgery on it or anything? Uh, Not they yet. They told her it's a 50-50 chance of walking again. Is this like me? We got you. We're not gonna let you drop or anything. You got a trap in water, that's why. Oh, okay. I got a what? Here's what the owner of the vehicle told the police. They told me I have a 50-50 chance of walking again if I have surgery, so we decided not to have surgery. Okay. Well, we, she does have she does have a warrant, right? She has a warrant? Sarge. Sarge, she does have a warrant? Yeah, it's out yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, and that's why she probably wasn't answering the officer's questions. You know, because she does. She probably knew she had a warrant, so... Hey, look, we're gonna. That way you can sit down in the in the in the, in the truck. That's affirmative. Stand by for confirmation. Ten four. Go ahead and get up. That's more up. There you go. All in picture has been sent. You don't have anything on you, right? I got mad because the way they dragged her out and I was yelling, watch her back. Yeah, we did. So we kept on dragging her out. After after we saw the injuries and stuff, we handcuffed in the front. We assisted her on her, on her side and got her up. I appreciate that. Experience. So no problem. Watch her. Yeah. What's bothering you, ma'am? You're back. Do you have any injuries? Higher injuries? Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Uh -huh. Uh, that is two accidents. Car accident? Uh, How recently? Not too long ago. I've been having problems with my bag. It's like blocks on me. I have so bad sometimes I can't even move. And I got a claw. Want to get anything out of your pockets? Huh? Do you have anything inside your pockets? This money. Yeah. Just money. Just money? Just money? Yeah. All right, we're, we're going to have to take everything else out of your pockets. The money too? Everything. Your money, whatever you have in your pocket. Get her down. Let's get her. Yeah. Have her stand up. Get out, get out of the unit. We're going to take everything out of your pockets, okay? Be careful. There's a stuff there. The officers found $10,000 and heroin in the female's bag. Here, we can just come right here. You can lean against your car, man. We're just gonna chat. Start right crying. What's that? They'll start crying. If oh, I we can chat right there. So. Well, I'll be right back, baby, okay? I'm just gonna come up here in the front, okay? I'll daddy be back. You stay right there. So, what was your name, man? Dennis. Dennis, and I'm Sergeant Caron. Sorry you're having to go through all this tonight, man. Yeah. Um, she's got some pretty bad warrants she's looking at. Mm -hmm. um, I thought they were just—they were already gone because that's back in 2007. How, do you, how do you know her? I'm married to her. You're married to her? 34 years. 34 years? Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, this September will be 34 years. Okay, I got you. So you're why? Um, do you know why she has so much money on her? She says that she don't like to put it in she the bank. It. I didn't even know she had that. But I know she don't. She had that. She don't. Uh, she don't like putting it in the bank because they done got me with uh, 7,500 in the bank, and then another time. They got me with three thousand five hundred. How'd they get you? Uh, somebody was taking it out of the bank. Did you file a police report? 
I filed a, no, I didn't file a police report, but I had an investigation okay. from the bank. Did they refund it? No. No? Usually with a police report, if it's legit, they'll refund it. Yeah, I don't like the police. Okay, well, <laughs> that's fine, man. I didn't, I didn't just said, oh, well, yeah. I lost it. With, I'll find out who it is, and I'll handle it. Okay, gotcha. Oh, gotcha. damn. So, is he, is he good to go? Yeah, he was just pulled he was over. There? He's just a driver on that. Okay. God. Yeah, I was in her pocket. Oh my gosh. So I don't know if there was more. Like, Dad, why do you have so much money? To in the bank. Oh. Uh, yeah. Sounds about right. Sounds about right. Okay. Go ahead and have a seat The officer attempted to gather more information about the female from her husband. What I'm worried about is if she has something in your vehicle, man, that she shouldn't have. Do you know of anything that's in your vehicle that shouldn't be in your vehicle? Nothing's in there. I just barely vacuum it, but it's all dirty again. Is it? Yeah, I know how that goes, man. Because the damn two little boys. Everywhere. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell, man. The back door's shedding, open. Shedding season. Yeah. So, is it okay if we search your vehicle and make sure she didn't need enough in this shit? What's that? Not without a warrant. Not without a warrant? Okay. Without a warrant. okay. Because uh, if y'all find something in the car, it's going to be mine. Because it's my car. Okay. And it's going to get blamed on me, so... Why do you say that? Because it's my vehicle. Well, you're not the one with walking around $10,000 on you. No, but I'm walking around a couple hundred. <laughs> that ain't nothing wrong, man, but... I'm just trying to figure out what's going on with her. Like How much is it? It's like 10000 Like 10000 Yeah. And that was your social security check? Well, all of them. All, and they're paid. All of them? Okay. All, all right, let's have a seat in there. Yeah. So she's 15 already, right? Yes. yes. Okay. Well, they confirmed her, her warrant already. No, this guy said they're still waiting for confirmation. Oh, okay. Ah. All right, hey, Susie, so this, these, these are going to be this a couple of questions that they're going to ask you at the jail. All right, and this is going to determine whether or not they need to... Um, they're going to require us to take you to CMC prior to taking you to the jail. All right, are you currently, obviously, you're you're under some doctor's care, correct? Now, listen to me just real quick. If you're under the influence of narcotics, you're not going to be charged for being under the influence of narcotics. I can't charge you for being under the influence of narcotic. But we need to know, one, because I, don't, I want to make sure you're not going to overdose in the back of my partner's truck, and I want to make sure you're not going to overdose when I get you to the jail, okay, because overdose is kind of serious, you know what I mean? So are you currently under the influence of narcotics? When was the last time you used narcotics? Well, let's be honest, okay? Susan? No. When was the last time you used narcotics? Was it today? Earlier today? I'm sorry? I'm sorry? When was the last time you, you used narcotics? That way we can tell the jail staff and that way we know if we need to take you to CMC first. Okay. When was the last time you used narcotics? I'm sorry? Susan, I need you to answer my questions, okay? Today. Today? Okay, what, what narcotics did you use today? Was it fentanyl? Yeah, okay, how much fentanyl did you use? I'm sorry? Was it, you know, remember, was it more than one pill? Was it pills? Yeah. Okay. Was it more than one? So. Okay, about how long ago do you think it was? Right now it's 3.30 in the morning. About how long ago do you think it was that you used uh, fentanyl? The husband's attitude toward the investigation heightened the officer's suspicions about the car. Bunch of heroin. Shit. Would, More uh, cash here. I would keep those separate. It's like an ounce of heroin. Hey. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll get a count. We'll get a count I like think, that, and then we'll hey, get a count of this. I think we need to get a paper for the car. I am in agreement because there's more. I, I can guarantee you. There's more I am. Car. I'm in oh, agreement because he's playing dumb. Like he's like, oh well, she saves her money, this and that. Like I asked for consent to search the car, and he's like, not without a search warrant, dude. We've got enough we're for a search warrant. Like ten thousand dollars. Yeah, and this like is an ounce. Of, yeah. Give us a second. I am in agreement, and we're not even done. I think I've been yeah. fucking discounted. Yeah, we already, well, we already, dude, we already have PC for trafficking. I say get a paper for that car. What's that? Yeah, I'll call. I'll yeah. call. Yeah. Uh, what happened? How'd you get the injury to your back? 
car wreck. Car wreck? How long ago was the car wreck? Uh, I don't remember how long it's been. I got into the car wreck like uh, two weeks apart. Oh, I see. I see. What did they diagnose you? What did they say was wrong with your back? Like surgery done to it. Say that again? I need surgery done to it. You need surgery done to it? Okay. You need help? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Here, I'm gonna lift up your foot, okay? Move it to the side, okay? I'm gonna help you twist over a little bit. Alright? Ready? Tell me if I'm hurting you. Am I hurting you? Yeah? You want me to stop? Yeah, should be. Yeah, should be alright. Here, are you ready to scoot over? You want me to help you? Yeah. I'm going to try to scoot you over, okay? One, two, Whoa. three. Got you. You okay? Yeah. We're going to get you to the hospital, all right? The police impounded the car for further investigation and released the female's husband. If they We're going to go it, ahead and tell paper. him to it's get like a ride. The only thing he can take out of that car is those dogs. Okay. Okay? But the car, right as of right now, is detained for a search warrant. Okay. So he cannot get anything out of that car. Is he, he get those guys? Is he out good to go? Then yes, he is good to go. We got his forty nine. Yep. All right, Dennis. So this is what we're going to explain to you. What's going to happen at this point in time? Your vehicle is being seized pending a search warrant. Okay. So what's going to happen is your vehicle is going to be taken back to the Carlsbad Police Department while our officers apply for a search warrant. All right. The only thing that you can have out of the vehicle are the dogs. All right, and we will get the dogs out of the vehicle for you. Then we're going to seal up the vehicle, and we're going to have it taken down to the Carlsbad Police Department. Just because I don't want to let y'all uh, search it? I'm sorry? Just because I don't want to let y'all um, search Officer Corporal Barker over there is the one doing the investigation. So whatever reasons he has for detaining the vehicle for a search warrant, that's that's uh, that's on Corporal Barker. All right? It has nothing to do with you denying consent to search. Yeah. All right? He already had, I guess, prior knowledge or prior um, information. Um, as far as talking to you, getting her out of the vehicle, things of that nature, which is why he's going to apply for a am I supposed to get home? If you have a cell phone, you'll be more than more than welcome to contact somebody for a ride. I don't have no friends. <laughs> How, where do you live at? Way out there on uh, uh, Sweetwater Park. Sweetwater RV Park? Yeah. You don't have anybody that can come and get you? No friends, family? Family, they don't talk to me or nothing. I don't why, have no friends. Why is that? Why, why won't your family talk to you? Oh, uh, because when I used to be an alcoholic, yeah. I used to beat them all up. Yeah, you just kind of burn bridges in your yeah, family back they, in the day. They don't like me at all. I got you. Because, you know, when I went to prison, gotcha. they called me a thief, a junkie, gotcha. and all that gotcha. shit. What did you go to prison for? Uh, what did I go to prison for? Burglary. Burglary? I got you. Are the dogs? Are the dogs mean? No, they're, they're playful. Come here, puppy. Come here. So here's one dog. Alright, All right, so as, as far as far as the cell phone, the cell phone's gonna be included in the search warrant. Okay, everything inside the vehicle is gonna be included in the search warrant. So I cannot allow you to have your cell phone. What's gonna happen is I'm gonna give you the dogs. Once we start finishing up here, we will, I'll give you a ride home. That way you're not stuck walking um, or anything like that, all right? Bye. I appreciate that. Come here, puppy. Come here. That baby boy. Baby boy. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come here, my baby. Come here, my baby. One of the officers helped the man leash up his dogs. What you could do, can I show you a trick? Yeah. I didn't want to take my back off. It feels no. good with the heat. I, you know, I guess. Look, what you can do, and it doesn't hurt the dog. It doesn't hurt the dog. You put it around like this. And doing it this way, it, it oh. If you do it that way, it allows for the leash to ru run through the, the loop of this right here. Mm -hmm. That way it's not choking them, but it also it stays around their neck. Okay? Mm -hmm. okay. So I'll let you hold on to that one. And then we'll do the same one, same thing with this one. And that way at least your dogs are secured. Mm -hmm. Whenever you're walking them, they won't be able to get off of it. You able to hold that one? Okay. All right, so like I said, we can give you a ride as close as you want. All right, if you don't want to take you, take you all the way to the, the RV park, we don't have to. Well, at I'll least, see how the at least, situation okay. is over there. Cause okay. At least let us You know, they see me getting out of cop car. Oh, he's snitching. Oh, this is going to be a dandy one. 
and then getting out if you need if you need help getting out, I'll I'll be more than happy to help you get out. Alrighty, sir. Just try to make it as easy as possible on you. Tell you what, at least at least these seats are cushion seats and they're not the hard plastic ones, huh? Yeah. Makes it a little easier on you. Well, my long legs here. Well, if you start cramping up, you let me know. We'll we'll okay. fix it. All right. All right. We're gonna be on our way. All right. Let's go get it. The female was taken to the hospital for further processing. What did they tell you? Did you ever go? Yeah. And then what happened? They wanted to go get operated on. And you just never went, or you don't want to have surgery? No, well, you you rather be like this? No, but I'd rather not be paralyzed either. I mean, if they're recommending surgery, yeah. it's for you to probably be better, and that way you can walk straight and everything. How long have you been like this? Since the accident. Since the which is what, like eight months? You said. A few months? Well, what's a few months? Like three months back, four months back? Something like that. So before about four or five months, you've been like that already? The female had a previous warrant and was additionally charged with trafficking controlled substances, resisting arrest, and no seatbelt. YouTube thinks you'll love the video on screen. Click to watch now.